The design philosophy of Wayne is all about simplicity and flexibility. For us, it's very important that we are able to adapt the system to the different environments. So during the pandemic, I started to use curbside pickup for the first time. And many of us probably have this experience of going to a mall or a retail location and picking up an order that we've placed. What the autoloader allows us to do is take that curbside pickup model and actually have the drone bring it to your door. So imagine an autoloader sitting outside of your favorite grocery store. When you place an order, your retail worker, your grocery store worker packages that up just like a curbside pickup order and rather than handing it to you in your car as you've driven to the mall, actually just placing that package on an autoloader and then a drone delivering that package to you. It basically consists out of three elements. So it has two arms that come out of the autoloader and they are there to capture the tether of the winch that deploys out of the drone. And then once that tether is captured, it goes into the second element, and we call this the pill computer. It's not as fancy as it sounds, but it's basically a nifty mechanical device that without any moving parts, rotates the hook into the correct orientation to attach to the package. And then the third part is where you attach your package to, and this is where the hook then engages with the package. All these three things work seamlessly together. And the beauty about that system is you don't have to be there while this happens. Designing in aviation, you can often design very complex electromechanical systems. But we wanted the autoloader to be simple. So it's actually unpowered. There's no electrical cabling you need to run to it. We worked really diligently to get to a very simple MVP, or minimum viable product, that did the basics. And then we leveraged our user research team here at Wing to put it in front of people and to see how they interacted with it. They quickly showed us where our product wasn't clear and wasn't yet intuitive. And from that feedback, we could use their questions and their assumptions, the ways that they use the autoloader in ways that we didn't expect to then leverage industrial design, form studies, color, and indicators in order to design a product that is much more intuitive, much more in line with other mental models that people have with curbside pickup.